Thanks, Clint. You had some of the best score streak usage we've seen. How are you able to make decisions like that when you're under so much pressure, pressure in a fast-paced game environment? Uh, just staying calm and uh, just making the best out of it. That's that's really what I do. I, I, I've been preaching in, the, in those games uh, for us to stay calm because uh, there's a lot of times in these games when teams are getting big leads and we've seen a lot of blowouts that turn into comebacks and it's it's really because you're just not staying calm and you're letting the pressure get to you. So yeah, I don't know. I, I think it's just me being calm and just that's who I am. So a common theme that I've heard when I've been talking to you guys and the casters have mentioned it is of course you guys are missing dashing. You have, you know, Zuma now and you've had a couple of role changes. What has the process been like or adjusting around all those factors? Well, it hasn't been too bad. I, I think we finished this week better than we thought we were going to. Uh, because of how the first series went, but going into that series, I think we played maybe five maps uh, because we just really couldn't. Um, and then since then, then we played UIU, we made another role change, and we played, um, I forget, sorry, whoever we played last night, we, we made another role change, and now we've stuck with that. But that's been the best one so far, and it, it, we're, we're feeling really comfortable. Uh, and we were saying to you before this map start, or match started, those were really good maps for us, uh, at least right now. They could be different when we have Brandon, we don't know. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. They have <laughs> the wrong maps. You guys have been playing better and better each match that we've seen, so what can we expect to see out of Optic for next week? Uh, I, I don't know. It, it really depends. Um, but right now, like I said, I, I'm really happy with how we're playing. Uh, I'm really happy with how Tommy's playing and how he's meshed, meshed with us. Uh, it was a really short notice, and I think this league is just really hard, no matter the division you're in. Um, so, I don't know. I, I expect better things. I, I think we're just going to keep getting better. All right, great. Thank you so much. This has been your PlayStation Instant Reaction. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this quick break. It's inevitable, they don't want button to press it Whatever the pull to get me to snap though And if I paid attention, I'm probably making it bigger But you've been taking your dicks on a fucking back, ho On the break in a minute, got me thinking of finishing everything with Skin, guns, karma, but now jump to a 1v1 Zuma versus Dens I spot him, what timing he just got I thought for a yeah. second Dins was going to be facing, get eyes on That's it, but a second right he there. turns Zuma. to get back towards elbow. Zuma! Zuma goes out flying, and he clutches up. Out of the game, this time played a little bit slower in the base. Now they're going to push this behind oh, the Tempest. Dens, though, able to find one. I think he had some help on that kill. I'm it, and all, <laughs> all Optigimi is, is hoping right there is that he can connect with this shot, but Dens does a great job just shouldering it, staying alive. Watch number five, that's Tommy in a very good position, but oh, it's oh, bad. Tommy bounces oh, off of Karma, oh. and Karma's able to connect it. Now it's the Tempest on the side of Reciprocity that comes out from Dens. But they actually yeah. hit each other. Close, yeah. They hit each other, so both Tempest drop, but Zuma's able to actually stay alive. Three on two now. Zuma working to get the plan. 25 seconds remaining. Krem6 looking over towards Elbow right as he gives up his ADS. The push comes through and he's going to get caught. Things may be falling apart for Optic, but Zuma at least able to get the plant and get away with his life. He's out. Good job, man. And it though. Oh, oh my god, what a clutch there. Oh from my Zed, the god. Be despair. You like to see the grab slam there? A lot of pressure on Tommy to hit a shot. They hit inner. There's the snap. Oh Scump. We'll god. see you later. Tommy's gonna re peek. He might get caught. He's got the Mozu out. Oh Tommy's my gonna get God. dropped, but Zed's still here holding an elbow. He pulls out the war machine. Zed pulls out the war machine and he uses the cluster. Plant in now from Optic. They have a 3v2. Out, he's gonna leave. Let him waste his war machine shots. And he's, you see TJ, I, I think he's holding a stun. He's holding a stun or, or a nade, but he's actually fine. Oh my a direct God. impact. It was a cluster that TJ was holding now on 1v2. Zuma's already clutched a 1v1. They just, I think Zen just spotted him. He just spotted him. He knows as well that they're going to push him. It looks like he found the timing. But he knows both players are going to be down here and wins one. Now can he stay alive? Oh. No. Den's able to get it in reciprocity. Going to take the search and destroy 6-4. to four. All tied up in one apiece. A lot of clutch moments late in rounds from reciprocity. Oh, man. Hate to see that. Man, I thought the they were going to sweep in them, bro. Did. But reciprocity, like, I just think I think this is much more important for them to get to 2-2, two and two, to get to 500. And there, it's just been nuts. Which I think I've said 700 times now, but there's no there's no other way to really talk about having a sub come in and losing maybe the best player in the world. <laughs> Clutch up, and they're doing it so far. They find the opening two kills, and bit by bit, they claw their way back into this. There's a third in the row from Reciprocity. Oh Optic are throwing this away. 
Reciprocity is now going into the site. They only have a two life advantage. One life advantage. Optic oh my torn god. The, map. the big lead is just gone. Reciprocity blow them off of frequency. And oh there's the W god. in round one. It can't be that easy. They didn't find a kill. You have Zuma with the saga. I mean, at least he's helping Tom in. See, it's going to be tough for him to find some kills. But there we go. Reciprocity fly on in. It's almost capped as well. And it looks like it should go the way of Optic Gaming. Good job, Optic. Good job. Reciprocity get the first round win. It's just before the CWL Pro League began, he really was nice. playing at a high level. Didn't have the, the best day one, but since then has turned Shot. it around. Well, he has streaks. Scuff has just found a couple as well as he has five in a row. Reciprocity yet to find a tick on either of them. The zones. Karma just goes soaring in, grabs the nice. there, gets one a jiggle. What? Almost takes the second gunfight as well. Heads up play by Krem to not just nice. find elevator points. Yes, yes, exactly. They at least have one of these points done. Good job, Optic. Oh my gosh, Karma. Karma frying right now. And if you're Optic, yeah, you throw so much at this. Oh With God. your use of the streaks, thinking maybe, you know, we close out the second round, then to get to get our third round oh on the board, goodness. we have all our specialist weapons to work with. Because they hold on to everything but the grab slam. Jesus. Just not enough time. Three lives. They try to slide in. Luck. They're ready and waiting. Can't get <laughs> through. And a nice defense for nice, off the nice, game. So nice, nice. they make sure they get the second round. Yeah. Take him out. But now he's got health to work with. He's no longer a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, no. You've got multiple players here. You've got oh, to use a stun to take him out. So many lives. It's a six life advantage now for Reciprocity. And Optic hasn't even thought about a point for 30 or 40 seconds. Yeah, Denton now gets a lightning strike of his own. Come on, Scum, though. Able to find some kills. All of Optic on A. Can they get that minute job, Optic. Go down. There it is. That's TJ's already pushed on push. up as well. They're going to try to double points. You can see a couple of players go to A. Three to B. A bit of a gamble here if you're Optic, but there's a lightning strike. They're going to try and win God. it right here. Just based off these rotations. There's the hell, the, the war machine as well. Flat oh check, it God. is out for reciprocity. But one player, number one, that was Tommy. Just went to A, and they don't even get A yet. Uh, there, there it's going to come in. It should be able to get it done as he has the Annihilator on the site. The TJ is still here. Oh, my Everyone God. To help. They have to finish A. It's going to be Crim6 who has to keep patrolling that. They need just another second or two, oh and they'll get God. the time added on. So there's the added 60 seconds. They've used everything. I mean, 9 to 8, they, they use Annihilator, War Machine. Tempest is out. Tempest boost. is out. Oh can we get to Zuma? Yeah, Tempest as well. If he can connect, yeah, he's able to connect with two. Nice shots out of Zuma. Can he get that player, Zed, being so annoying? And now he's back up, but he does oh. get dance. But now Wuskid with the Annihilator as well. All the specialists being pulled out here. Oh it's my mayhem God. in game three. <laughs> Six lives for Optic. Four oh now for Reciprocity. God. Wuskin, he's got to hit some shots. He's got three left. What he's got to hit some shots. Around. Can't oh do my it. God. Two left. He's stunned. He's picked. Last man. <laughs> Dins, he's out. And that is Let's back to back. Clutch on up. Damn. Able to find kills. Now it's TJ's turn. And just pretty back and forth. Near this garage area, but Reciprocity do Good have job, the close spawns, but Karma is still here. Had such a great game three, and all the kills are the way of Optic. And he is being such a pain to deal with the plays through water. That'll Good be just alive. Somehow he's just still up, alive. Oh just finessing God. Reciprocity. And do it. And this is what we've seen to be more common. Oh kind of holding this hard point from oh the front. Oh my God. Oh my yeah, God. He's pretty good. Doesn't win the gunfight, but. So far away, Westin though able to break on in, and now he has his team spawn in Boathouse, but Krim set up with that ICR. Optic Gaming stabilizes, Zuma and TJ able to find some kills, spots Tommy as well in the water. That's gonna be a kill, cluster on in, forces Karma in a weird situation, but TJ just being so annoying from the top balls. Yeah, I think TJ and that believe Zuma. he forced oh my him God. to the stun. I believe they got the stun out right, you saw kind of Tommy, I think, holding it right before they push, so you're getting shot in the back, you push forward, you catch a stun. And reciprocity gets cleared. Oh and this is what I'm talking about. Karma's just making sure they can't push through garage, right? Just look at look at where Wuskin spawns out. You have a couple of spawns by that boathouse. Just forces a lot of different pushes out of reciprocity. But the lead now very strong. And now you have Zuma who's on a bit of a five spree. Got all his kills on this hill. Has full streaks and we know how dangerous streaks can be on a map like Hacienda because well we saw it when Midnight played out gaming earlier this week. It was Brack who changed the game for them. Ed. Tommy, 
not investing these streaks yet, but nice use of the wiggle there. Stock able to get the juke and connect with the shots. Nice plays. Him and Karma oh, working damn, together dude. there in the top hallway. He was such a nuisance. Yep, he won multiple one-on-ones. Oh Here's another one. Will allow his teammates to start to rotate towards him. And this is the exact same position. He has grabbed some as well, but Zuma's going to call in the drone squad to help him out. He's able to stay alive, put some damage down. Here comes the rest of his team. Uma. Able to oh, soar out and shut him down. Oh, Karma baby. wants to go for the grab slam, <laughs> and he's going to pick up too. Three. This has been, yeah, this has been man, Karma's a point. freaking oh. beast, man. Oh, oh my god. As well. And this has been, I mean, a story for Optic Gaming for years. When Karma is playing well, they are infinitely more dangerous. You just had to be like that, that right there. You had to be able to trade, Gotta trade. that. You had to trade that. Like, right now, it's, it's a story of the individual talent of Optic is just showing off as TJ is able to find three. You already have Karma in position to rotate towards fences. Crim's in the hill. And win another one on one. You can see Weskin struggling at 8 and 20. Shawnee Jesus. not playing too well either. But Optic looking comfortable. Oh my he hasn't God. even had Crim 6 approaching streaks as well as he's 190 off. Uh, make it 65 off. Just looking for the final one. There it is. More streaks, more toys, more to use for Optic. Off again. There can't get him. A team yeah, kill zoom. comes in behind the Hellstorm, but may not matter. How many nades have we now seen thrown into that trophy? There's 18 more points oh needed. Goodness. There's 18 on the clock. You have to get another contest. They can win it here. They've got to be able to get in. Look how far spread out. Optic yeah, just yeah, fanning yeah. out, making sure they can't get in. Mid might be the last hit. That's the last opportunity. That's going to be Scump that's holding it. Oh, Andy got Zuma here with the oh, Tempest. Get in. You get him for a second, so yeah, you can't win it. There's at least one more rotation, but it's 247 to 77, Joe. It's, it's a lot. It's a shame. It's a shame. This has been a very, very close series. Reciprocity yeah. has played Optic very tough. You just hate to see them go out like this. Reciprocity has played everybody tough. Just, just don't want to go out like this, though. I guess no. just, uh, that's a tough loss to swallow. Especially to end your week on. You know, Reciprocity is going to be one and three after this. Optic three and one. And there we go. Almost. Oh, but they're whoa, still whoa. alive. They're still alive. I'm just now they're dead. Damn. <laughs> Optic get the victory three Woo. to one. Some real uh, stellar performance. Yo, Scum's not been performing stage. lately. He hasn't been performing as he should be. But yo, Karma's like overperforming right now, which is absolutely crazy. I think Zuma's filling his role pretty good. Uh, subbing in as for Dash. He's doing a pretty good job, man. You know, coming into this week for Optic Gaming, it's not the hardest schedule, but you had to play Midnight. Maybe that's the only game, even with Dash, you would say. Potentially, there's a chance they drop it. We don't know yet. But I, yet. you know, I, I expected them to, to beat Reciprocity, to beat EYU, to, to beat EG. So maybe, you know, they, there's some luck on the side just due to the schedule. They don't have to play teams like Red or LG, Gen G, who we know can be very tough opponents. But three and one with the sub in the Pro League against some of the best teams in the world, you'll take that. Well, Karma, you saw the plays he was making towards the garage hardpoint throughout that game. He was incredible in the series, and we have him on stage with your PlayStation Instant Reaction.